up? This is another Minecraft Let's Play video. Another video inside of my Hunger Games maps. Okay, this is my Hunger Game world. Uh, as you guys see, it's all in creative. But, you know, I'm just going to make a whole lot of Hunger Game maps. And then I will um, do a, a real Hunger Game. So I, when you can switch from survival to cre or, or creative to survival. Okay, so I have two Hunger Games maps. I made both of them each in one day. This is the easier one because I did not have to expand like so much. I didn't have to mine all the dirt and everything on the flat world and put cut and put stuff down. I didn't have to make walls or anything. All I did was simple, simple, simple. Cause yeah, the rest are gonna be really simple. This is the hardest one to build so far. Um, yeah, this is my room. Uh, if you guys notice this, I'm kind of done. I don't know if I'm going to add anything else. So, like, I think I'm going to add my clone, a be another bed for him to stand on, and a book bookcase. But, okay. So, I have all my Minecraft helpers in here, including some of my favorite little animals that I've had throughout the years. Alright. So, here's the first one. This is LI-12 Rebel. You guys remember him? He has his classical nothing uh, iron boots on with a diamond sword guarding me while I am sleeping. And I have my classical diamond shirt, uh, diamond chest plate on, and diamond and iron boots. This is PZ. You guys all remember him, poor Chub Zoomer. He is still alive, roaming around my lovely world. This is just another little extra added thing. Um, just a random chest along with that one, and yeah, so, uh, this actually moved over, so yeah, that's why I have it near the glass now. This is that painting thing where Stitch comes out of, and as you guys can see, there's Stitch right now. He is riding on the angel of Super Sheep, because Super Sheep sadly died. I saw a skeleton actually kill him, okay? Um, and this is Hero Brian, you guys all remember Hero Brian. He is my friend, Luke, and yeah. I added him to my love garden, and he is wearing his classical, um, iron helmet. This is just that not nice enderman that I finally killed. He is hissing at me, as you guys can see. And this is Daniel, the evil guy, the evil Daniel. He's my hit the target. And as you guys can see, my favorite one of all. He is not my favorite, but Riley NYR99. He actually killed Daniel for me one time. But that was like before um, he did bad stuff to my world. He actually exited with a couple of diamonds, but I got really mad at him. So yeah, he he is actually guarding him. All right, so that's everything that I added in this world. I also added a little, tiny little balcony. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys how to play. All right, so basically, um, first some someone starts over here, and you gotta flip all three chests. If we're playing in creative, and if you get hit by an arrow, we will be able to see it. So yeah, uh, first I would be playing with Stitch, but maybe in the next video, maybe. All right, so first you go like this, you flip all three chests, and then you and then you have to run, and you have a two-minute grace period. So that's the period whenever you can flip and as many chests as you want. There's no flying, um, but whenever you can add stuff in chests, this is what it is. Um, I put chests over here. I put a chest on, I think I put actually two chests maybe. I know I put a chest on top of uh, LI-12 Rebel's shoulder. I put some fake torches as well. Uh, I put a chest right next to my head. I also put some, a bunch of chests in here. Uh, one's going to be full of diamonds. And uh, one's going to be with little diamonds and that's it. And this place over here, I have like cake and stuff. I have that classical cake on top of the glass block. And this is super sheep too. So yeah. Um. Okay. And yeah. Oh, sorry about that, guys. There's something. Oh, all right. And I made the bed. And yeah. So in this video today, we are going to just be making another bed in bookcase. That's all. It's very very simple. So you guys don't know how to do it, it's very easy and very simple. So my clone, he has his classical nothing on. So, alright. You guys can actually also get, like, a model for you, but I don't really need that. So I'm going to need a model for the bookcase, so. I'm also going to need some wool. I'm not used to looking at bookcases. That's why I got a one. And I'm also going to need 
some of this. So this, we're just gonna make the bed really quick. So if you guys don't know uh, how to do, all you have to do is this. Or I mean a giant bed. And then you do two, two of those, like that over there. And I think, how much did I space them apart? I think I spaced them two blocks apart, yeah. Um, I actually found a way to sprint on PE without flying or anything. All I have to do is, see my screen? You have to jump and go like this at the same time. So this works on survival way more easier than it does on creative because the controls are a little weirded out because you have to double tap and go like that to fly. So the controls are a little weirded out from that, that's all. And then you put the two blocks um, because it has two things there and your head actually goes on the some of the your some like a quarter of your head actually goes on the um pillow uh three quarters of your two quarters of your head or three quarters of your head goes on the pillow and then the rest goes actually on the thing actually it's thirds i think i don't know but anyway so yeah it's pretty cool um <laughs> This will count as a video, because I think I have like 34 videos now, 37, oh. but I'm actually booming of, with the videos, everybody's loving them, I actually have, well the only, the real life videos I don't think have any views, but every other video has at least, has at least one view, which is pretty cool, so I'm actually very happy about that, um, yeah, and I have only two subscribers it feels kind of weird so i i'm gonna try to remember to say please subscribe and comment at the end if you want to be led to my love garden uh, so I'll, I'll say that at the end okay um yeah so that there we go that, that was quicker than i thought and then we just do the same thing that we do on the other side okay all right well, all right um so yeah um, I'm gonna be bombing with the videos um, because I have uh, uh, I'm in the middle of a uh, President's Week break from school, so we could do a bunch of videos, uh, and especially tomorrow because we have like nothing to do, and Stitch will be on a bunch of them. Okay, so now to make the clone. So what you need to make a purse, a giant person. Actually, you know what? Let's do the bookcase first. So you're gonna need some oak logs for going in and some wool. I'm just gonna make red, blue, and green books. Maybe some yellows. Red, blue, and green, that's all. Alright, now, well, first what you have to do is place your thing anywhere. Um, just to see what it looks like. Alright, so I do not know if the back actually has... Oh, it does have books. Okay. So, first thing is first. You have to make your book. Alright, so it's going to be the same. All things are the same size, so... I think it's gonna be like now I'm, I'm making the frame, so maybe it's gonna be that big. No, I'm gonna have to make it like three blocks tall, three, uh, two blocks tall, maybe like this. Mm, yes, that's good because now I can put books in there. And now I'm gonna just double it up, not double, I'm gonna triple it up actually because, yeah. Alright, um, I'm gonna fix it the rest later, but, alright, this is basically what the frame is, so, yeah, um, okay, this is a very confusing thing to do, don't worry if you guys don't get it on the first time, I did not get it on the first time either, because I, I tried before, but, you know, it didn't work, alright, so here we go, this is what it should look like, uh, and then you just put this, like, oops, no, stupid glitches, alright, you know, let's just ignore it for now. There, it's better now. Because if you just ignore it and you don't like put the tile or anything, it will get fixed. Alright, so I'm gonna put a red book. I'm gonna put a blue book. I'm gonna put a blue book, a green book, and a red book. A red book, a green book, a blue book. Oh wow, I did not actually mean to do that at all. So I'm gonna actually put a green book, a red book, and another green book right here. And then I'll put a blue book, and this is gonna be the secret place. Now I'm just gonna hit a chest. All right, so now it's turning nighttime, and we'll make the clone in the morning. So yeah, make our clone in the morning. Um, 
actually in one of my next video it doesn't really look like a good bookshelf but you know it's better it's easier it's actually easier said than done really anyway um but my we're actually gonna clone stitch in another video so that's it for today uh we're gonna make the clone in the next video so i mean yeah the clone in the next video bye